Hi, I'm Grace, New Meds Product Device Specialist, and today I'm going to be taking you through the Hugo Pro and how to use it. The Hugo Pro is a professional and home use PMF therapy device. It has a combined magnetic field strength of 12,000 Gauss when using the top and bottom full body mats. The device will offer 8,000 Gauss from the localised loop coils and the rope coil. The whole system uses a frequency range of 1 to 50 Hz. Included in your box, you'll find your Hugo Pro unit driver, your single loop coil, your double loop coil, your rope coil, your dummy cord, two full body mats and a power lead cable. The Hugo devices allow you to use your applicators one at a time or in conjunction with each other. Two full body mats are provided with the Hugos so you can create a sandwich effect. To do this, you just need to lay one of the mats underneath you and one on top of you. If you're going to use just one applicator at a time, you need to remember to plug in your dummy cord to the set two. But in this example, we're going to use two applicators in both sets. Start by plugging in the power supply to your wall socket and then take the other end and plug it into the input on the front of your device. Please note that the Hugo Pro can only be powered by mains power. In this example, we're going to be plugging in a full body mat and a localized loop applicator. Take the two inputs on the mat applicator and plug them into the top and bottom ports on set one. Make sure your colors correspond and turn them all the way to the right until you hear them click. You can then go ahead and repeat this process for your second applicator into set two. Once all your applicators are plugged in, you can go ahead and turn the device on by switching the on button on the front panel. You're then going to hear the fan inside the device start to operate. Before you start your session, just ensure that your intensity dial is pushed as far to the left as it can until you get some pushback. To start a session, just click your start pause button once. You'll then see the timer start to count down from 12 minutes. It's preset to 12 minutes because that's the maximum recommended session time. As your timer starts to run down, you can start to slowly increase your intensity dial to the right until you get to a point that you're comfortable with. For your first few sessions, we do recommend a low and slow approach. What I mean by that is a small session time and a lower intensity dial. The higher the intensity gets on the dial, the lower and slower the frequency pulses become. If for any reason you need to pause your session, just click the pause button. Once your session is finished, you need to click the reset button to reset the timer and then ensure that your intensity dial is pushed again to the left as far as it will go until you get some pushback. This is setting you up ready for your next session. We do recommend waiting a few minutes to let the fan cool the spark gap chamber inside the device back down. Once you've waited a few moments, you can go ahead and switch it off using the same button that you used to switch it on. Only when the device is switched off, you can go ahead and unplug your applicators. If you have any questions about the products we've discussed today, please do not hesitate to contact us.